Hi everyone, I have a story today to read to you called The Very Quiet Cricket. The story is by Eric Carl, same author and illustrator as The Grouchy Ladybug and The Very Hungry Caterpillar. He has made so many interesting books. All right. One warm day from a tiny egg, a little cricket was born. Welcome, chirped a big cricket rubbing his wings together. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. Can you pretend like you're rubbing wings together? Take your hand and rub like this, your hand nice and flat. Rub, rub, rub. You're going to try to help the cricket. But nothing happened, not a sound. Good morning, whizzed a locust spinning through the air. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. Get those hands and give them a nice rub, rub, rub. But nothing happened, not a sound. Hello, whispered a praying mantis. Scraping its huge front legs together, the little cricket wanted to answer. So he rubbed his wings together. Rub, rub, rub. But nothing happened. Not a sound. Good day, crunched a worm, munching its way out of an apple. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. Rub your wings together for me. But nothing happened, not a sound. Good afternoon, screeched a cicada, clinging onto a branch of a tree. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. Rub, 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 help that cricket. But nothing happened, not a sound. How are you, hummed a bumblebee flying from flower to flower. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. But nothing happened, not a sound. How do you think that cricket's feeling? Do you think he wants to make a sound? Yeah, he really wants to, but it's not working. Good evening whirled a dragonfly gliding above the water. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. Rub, rub, rub. But nothing happened, not a sound. Good night, buzzed the mosquitoes, dancing among the stars. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. Rub, rub, rub. But still nothing happened, not a sound. A luna moth sailed quietly through the night and the cricket enjoyed the stillness. How can you be still? As the luna moth disappeared silently into the distance, the cricket saw another cricket. She too was a very quiet cricket. Then he rubbed his wings together one more time. Rub those wings for me. And this time, he chirped the most beautiful sound that she had ever heard. The end. That cricket finally got to make his sound. Maybe he just needed a little practice each time and then he finally did it. All right, thanks for listening to the stories.